What's going on? So today we are gonna react to a video, another banger. So today we're gonna react to panhandlers. So if you don't know what those that is, that's basically fake homeless people out there. People people just fake being homeless so they get money. Or like they don't have food, they don't like uh, whatever. So they fake being homeless, they fake they they fake that they don't have any money. So they get money. So there's, they're basically lazy to go, go do a job, to go get a job. So, without further ado, we're gonna, I'm on YouTube here, I'm gonna react to some panhandlers. Alright, this YouTuber is pretty cool. No, I'm just gonna switch to this channel. Huh? Oh, this one. This guy. He does a bunch of YouTube videos. Of, uh, well, like fake homeless people. Shout out to this guy. So, we're gonna go ahead and react to a video today of fake homeless people. And there's one that is very popular. This one. Family bust. What do you want? Family busted at panhandling. Family busted at Walmart. For some reason, all these panhandling, these fake homeless people are always at Walmart. This is very weird. So we're gonna go ahead and react to this. Hold on. This is freaking ads. So I just got a message that the white van with the parents and two children are back at Walmart begging for food and gas. Now, I don't have a problem with people doing that. I mean, if you're really down on your luck and you're, I mean, out of food and gas and whatever the situation is, you should, you know, get out and try to do something. But three, four times a week, same spot. You know what? You need to get out and find a job is what you need to do. And stop begging. So, I'm gonna go sit out. Okay, 42 seconds in. So people actually give money to these people. Like, some people don't believe that they're homeless, they don't have any gas or something, they don't have any food. They actually believe that they don't have that stuff, that they don't have anything. So, that's actually a little bit like crazy so watch for these people they they look like they're homeless but they're not so and these these guys look so obvious that they're not homeless somewhere and see if i can't watch these guys oh yeah no gas no food these guys are pathetic place I can go sit where uh, they can't really see me but I can see them oh I'm yeah. some happy they're right there the white man they're right there so probably for about the last the two or three right weeks there. I've been hearing about a family in a white van all right so it's right there the 2005 Honda Odyssey the old school Odysseys so, the white man right there. I've already watched one woman bring something over to him. As the guy. Right there, no gas, no food. Please help my, and then his family's over there. He literally's got a sign and wrote that with a sharpie. Literally. No gas, no food. Please. 
please help my and his family's off to the side there. I really don't think this is the way you should be teaching your family how to live. There's no reason that uh, someone's not working. Because that, that is not working. Oh my god, look at that. People actually give money. You see that? Don't worry. In a little bit, I'll be walking out and uh, confronting them because. Oh, this guy gonna give money? This I guy just the don't kiosk? see why this is happening. I mean, there's plenty of help available if you need it. You know, it was quite a few weeks ago that this guy. Yeah. You know, it was probably a few weeks ago that mm -hmm. I first heard that guy, he's okay. He just got some money because he just stuffed it in his pocket. So they do. They do. They, they, they fake it. But it was probably two or three weeks ago that I heard about these, uh, this couple was here with their white minivan. Said they were out of gas, traveling. And from what I heard, a lot of people helped out. Now here we are a few weeks later and they're back. Now I heard somebody told me on Facebook that they it? were just up in Marquette at a Walmart about two weeks ago. So I'm just wondering, is this the new way of life where you travel across the country and you know it's best for you. Or make a living? Oh okay, okay. This is you guys are, are too nicely dressed and I Let's see where they are. Guy actually comes out now. Comes out of the, his car and then the guy who's filming. Look, somebody else is stopping Jason to help him out. Selling, he comes out of his car and then he literally goes talk with him. Goes and talks to him. He's such a savage. And another one. Are you kidding me? Seriously, people. Look, three cars. One, two, and three. He's sitting there. Alright. That's just enough. Huh? Oh, no, I'm not doing pictures. I'm doing video. I'm just kind of curious to see what's going on, you know? Huh? Passing through. No, you guys have been here for a couple of days. You were here two weeks ago. You were here about a month ago. Um, you were up in Marquette at a Walmart a couple of weeks ago. So I'm just wondering if you're actually passing through or if this is just I'm trying to make a living. Show their faces. Because honestly, I think they're just listening. Out here making a living. You guys are, are too nicely dressed to not have food or gas. That minivan is nicer than my minivan. I struggle. My wife works. But I'm not out here begging for food and begging for money as my little children sit here and watch. No. I, you know what, I, I've, people on Facebook have told me that they've given them every number in the book to call locally here, all the churches. There's a, um, we just had a food drive a couple of days ago, and I bet you they didn't go. So I'm just wondering, you know, how long you're going to be here for, and, you know. Couple last week, he did not go back to my home. He needs all he needs. He needs to take one home here. Maybe the people help him. Yeah, but sitting out here and teaching your children to beg, that's no, not. My kids is okay. Look how you dress. You dress really nice. She's dressed really nice. Hey, the guy says teaching his kids right. You call that teaching right? Trying to beg for money on the road? Literally. Like, that's not right, man. That's not right. Sorry. Sorry for pausing it. You guys obviously have, you know. In my opinion, that's not right to teach your kids to literally sit on the road, literally sit in a freaking van, and just beg for money. Like, hey, can you give me money? That's basically. In my opinion, that's wrong. Last like, week? No, last week. Last week. Last week. Right now, it's changed. 
Can we have any more? There's, there's plenty of places up and down the street as you drive that say, help wanted, help wanted. I'm not telling you to leave. Yeah, this you can guy is like, all you want to. I'm just... This guy has an accent, so he's probably like, what, Asian or something? Well, I'd like people to have a, a good story and, and to, uh, an idea as to why you're yeah, here. Just for I mean, I, I see Florida. So are you staying with a sign? People promise to help me for all. You want the people to help me for all? But move my family into a van and move out onto the street. Hey? Better living, right? It's good. All right, well, you know. There's plenty of places to work if you want to look. But I haven't seen you out here before, but I've been hearing about you week after week after week. So I'll go to the next city, and I'm sure I'll make sure that people see your face and they know where you're coming from. So I suggest leaving. Have a great day, though, eh? God bless. Apparently, he's never heard of a video camera before. <laughs> so again, you know, if you're going to, uh... What? I'm not going to call the cops. I know they were out here already. No, I'm not calling the cops. Why would I call the cops? Oh, no, I don't care about the cops. Oh, I don't care about them. They can come if they want to. You said you have a phone. Feel free to call anybody you want to. I don't. I don't need to call. I don't need to talk to them. I think I've seen enough already. Thank you. Okay, I'm crazy. Bye bye. Bruh. Have a great day. <laughs> wow. Anyway. If you want to give money to those people, you feel free, because that's just dumb. <laughs> wow. Wow, man. Anyways, guys, thank you all for watching. This is just crazy how people do this. Like, it's like the, it's like literally the job. It's not, they don't, they're not actually homeless, they're faking it. They're basically going to like a Walmart or like a store outside, like in the parking lot, and they just bring their van, and then they, they act like they're like, they bring their stuff, they make it look like they're homeless. That's just like crazy, like, why do you, and how do you do that, man? Just get a freaking job, they're just lazy, man. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching, please sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.